This is it, guys and gals, the new thing, the moving, grooving thing. You said school was a bummer. Well, baby, it ain't no more. This is... Top 40 Education with the one and only... Doc Rock. Now keep your ear pressed to that blackboard, because we're switching to English Central and Super Prof. Gotta learn to dance before we learn to walk. Gotta learn to spell before we learn to talk. And Super Prof's here to please with the ABCs. Super Prof, Super English time. Correct this sentence. I want my pimple should clear up. Tired of classes that keep throwing the book at you? Well, now you can sign up for one that'll let you use your own hands to make valuable objects. By the time we got to Woodshop, we were half a million strong. Everybody's heading for Woodshop. Stop by and talk to the carpenters. Before you know it, you'll be making your own hat racks, birdhouses, wooden legs. Check it out today. You can study the moon or the balloon. You can analyze the moon on a sector rack balloon. Science man with a big B biology. Today we're going to study bacteria. How we're going to infect ourselves with botulism right after this message. And now a statement of editorial opinion from Mr. Harry W. Keister, general manager and principal. It has come to our attention that large numbers of pupils have been walking in the halls without a pass. From now on, if you are caught in the halls without a pass, you will be shot. Thank you. And now, the news. Professor Scoop with the latest poop. A big fight in the second floor boys' washroom puts washroom monitor Bruce Purvis in the infirmary again. Sophomore chemistry lab is raided by the narc squad. The principal reports that someone has stolen his desk. And in the lunchroom, milk goes up a penny today after the threat of a strike by Bessie and Viola. Now, down to our between periods traffic spotter. This is flying patrol boy Billy Bumpo cruising on the first floor just north of the tardy office. Traffic is moving very... Oh, oh, a locker is open and a bunch of books have fallen on the floor. Traffic is really backing up. It's a bad one. If you have a class at this end of the first floor, I suggest you attend an alternate class on the second or the third floor. Well, that's the bell. We'll be back with another flying traffic report between fourth and fifth periods. Now we switch you down to phys ed. This is Viz Ed here with the gym class. Today we're going to meditate. Ready now. Meditate. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Come on, everybody meditate here. One, two. You there. You're not meditating. One, two, three, four. Okay. Now we're going to do some inhaling exercises. But first... This message! Where can you go between 12 and 1? Where can you go for a fight or fun? Where can you get sick each day at noon? Gang the lunchroom. No far out organic foods, just good old American oatmeal burgers. Stupendous grease flavored french fries. Delicious chocolate milk chock full of nourishing wax. It's all in the lunchroom where you get yesterday's food today. This is Nancy Fancy with Home Economics. Today we're going to learn about our clothing. And the way we're going to learn is by making an actual piece of clothing we can wear ourselves or give to a friend. We are going to tie dye a tie. Now watch carefully. First, we take the tie we're going to dye and tie it. When the tie is tightly tied, we dip the tie in the tie-dye dye. When the tie-dye tie is dry, we untie the tie and take the dye we've just applied and set it aside. Retie the tie-dye tie, take another dye, dip the retied tie in this dye too. Take it out, let it dry, untie the tie, and you've got a tie-dye tie. And that tie is not all you can tie-dye. You can tie-dye a tutu, too. Take the tutu, tie the tutu, dip it in the dye, let it dry like the tie we dyed. Now tear the tutu in two. Now you've got two tutus to tie-dye. Take the two ties you tie-dyed and the two tutus you've torn in two and tied and dip them in the dye.